Alright guys, what game are we playing today? We are playing Word, Word, Word on the Street. Junior. Word on the Street. Junior. Word on the Street. Junior! Okay, fine. Now I heard it. We'll play Junior first. Do you guys like Word on the Street? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Why do you like Word on the Street, Brooke? I like it because it's a tug against letters. So it's like a tug of war with letters. Yeah. Alright, Brooke, so how do you play Word on the Street, Junior? Well, what you do is, first of all, the people split into two teams. And then you just try and get eight tiles on your side. Eight of these letter tiles? Yeah. Well, how do you get those tiles on your side? What you do is you take a card, and we got a body part. Oops, I'm supposed to flip that. We got a body part. Okay. And then you think of a body part, and like someone says, ear, or nose, or tongue. And while the time is going for the junior one, you just think of a word. And then once it runs out, you can do the word. And then someone just says, intestines! <laughs> okay, so you pick the intestines for your word? Yeah. And then and how do you get them onto your side after you've picked your word? You start out by going... I and and keep going on until you spell intestines. So go oh. ahead and spell. <laughs> I don't know. How but to in spell. junior, what's great about in junior is that that's why the time runs out because now you can all work together to make sure you spell it right. Oh. And then e and then s and then t again. So t got I, moved twice. And then n, then e. So when the letters get over all the way to your side, all the way, then, then that's one of your tiles and you can't move it back onto the board. But if the other team uses a letter that you... Yeah, I'll play, I'll play, the, I'll play the other team. Okay. About that. So she, what's great about intestines is that moves all of these letters <laughs> twice. My yeah. Goodness. So then it's our turn and we say another word for small. So our team discusses it while the time goes. And I'm going to look, well, I don't want these letters to go off, so what if we come up with a word like tiny? I know it's a short word and doesn't get many letters, but it'll save the T, the I, the N, and we'll get our Y a little bit closer. So it gets a little bit closer back to our side and stops them. But you didn't wait until the time ran out. I know. I will next time. But that's just an example. All right. So how, what's different from Word on the Street Junior than Word on the Street? Well, I'll, tell, I'll take this one, because now it's Word on the Street, because what's great about Word on the Street is this is a game that we've pulled out. Since we've had it, we've pulled it out at all the parties we've had. And like usual when we have parties is we split it into men versus women. Uh -huh. And so there's plenty of discussion and plenty of talk. It's the same thing. You've got a little bit different in tiles. You've got nice tiles versus the juniors got a little bit cardboard tiles. Mm -hmm. The biggest difference is you'll see the spacing, because there's less letters here. There's no vowels. There's no J, Q, Z. So a little bit trickier, and because you have to get eight on the, your side, I mean, yeah. there's usually only a couple left at the end. So you get down to the end, and there's four letters you're probably fighting over. Uh -huh. um, and so you also get a little bit tougher things. So, for example, something that is intentionally burned. Marshmallows! Yeah, we could go with marshmallows, because those get burned at our campfires all the time. Huh? <laughs> or something depressing on the back. There's also the front and back, same on the junior. The blue side is supposed to be a little bit harder or more specific words. But overall, that's how you play it. The difference is also with in Word on the Street is you have to move the letters while the time's still running. So you have to come up with the word and move the letters at the same time. Oh, so yeah. if the time runs out while the timer's still going, you have to stop. Exactly. Mm. Yep. All right. Well, what would you guys rate this? Well, that was an easy. I got it at 4.5. 4.5? Yes, it is right up there. It is a fantastic game. And Junior makes it even better for family, so we can split up. Since there's six of us, it's easy to split into two teams and, and go at it. All right. Well, thanks, guys. You bet.